in this video, I am going to show you how to send multiple sensors data to ThingSpeak IoT Cloud using SIM 800 LGSM and GPRS module. This project does not require any Wi Fi connection. I am using SIM 800 LGPRS connection to connect to the internet. I have used simple AT commands to connect to the internet and send the sensors data to cloud platform. I am using three sensors in this project. DHT11 humidity temperature sensor, MQ2 LPG gas sensor, and MQ7 carbon monoxide sensor. I am getting data from these sensors and send them to ThingSpeak using SIM 800 LGSM module. Let's see how I made this project. Let's get started. Here is the connection diagram. Follow the diagram to connect the components. I have connect all the components on breadboard as per circuit diagram. To power SIM 800L, I am using 3.7 volts and at least 2000 mAh battery. Most of the time, SIM 800L blinks 11 times and then start blinking once every 3 seconds. When it start blinking once every 3 seconds, it's mean it is connected to the network and ready for accepting AT commands. Next step is, go to ThingSpeak website, and create an account. I have already created the account. Just sign in. And then create a new channel, by clicking on, new channel button. Enter your project name here. Next, create four fields here. Write the name for first field. Temperature. Second. Humidity. Third. MQ7 data and fourth MQ2 data and then below click on save channel button I have already created the channel so look at the channel here is the dashboard to see channel fields click on channel setting here you can see the same setting that I have discussed before next click on API keys here is API key and below, you can see API URL. Copy only the part of URL that is highlighted. This will be used in the code. So, go to the Arduino sketch. You can download the code from the link in the video description. Scroll down and paste the API URL here. Next, enter the API key here. Then go back and copy the key and then paste that key here. Then set the APN, username and password of your SIM card network provider. Find them from Google. My SIM card network provider is Telenor. And here are the credentials. First, copy the APN and paste it here. Similarly, enter the username and password. The code setup has been completed. Now compile and upload the code. After upload complete, open serial monitor. Here you can see all the sensor data as well as the response of all the AT commands that I have used in the code is being displayed here. This is how you can send data to cloud. If you have any question, then comment below. See you in another video. Bye.